The most difficult thing about a Salesforce career is getting your first Salesforce job. But to find that Salesforce job, you need experience, Salesforce experience. And how do you get that? Everyone says that you need to find an internship, a nonprofit where you can volunteer. But how do you find that volunteer opportunity? Where is that internship? Where can you look for it? How do you find that internship? How do you find that volunteer opportunity? I will exactly show you how right now. The first website we'll look at is called volunteermatch.org. Here you can search for volunteer opportunities. Say I live in New York, searching using the Salesforce keyword. And I'm looking for anything in the New York City. All right, let's do a search. And you see, seeking a Salesforce developer. Okay, this for someone new, this could be pretty tough to be a Salesforce developer. But if you can, if you have some Salesforce development experience, this could be worth going for. This would be an amazing internship opportunity where you actually work as a developer. And look at this one, Salesforce consultant. Customize database for a purpose and acclimate me to use it. So this is basically a um, Salesforce admin position, yeah? The database is unfunctional for a non-profit. It's, they don't even know if they're in the non-profit starter pack. So this is an amazing opportunity who is willing to spend their time, who's willing to work many hours and figure things out and help the nonprofit organization figure out how to use their Salesforce better. This is an amazing opportunity. If you're in New York, go ahead and apply. At the end of the internship, after three, four months, you have the title Salesforce consultant. This is amazing. Let's see what they got here. This is not Salesforce focused internship. So I'm looking for Salesforce focused internships. Business development. Okay, this could be a Salesforce opportunity because a lot of nonprofits use it to fundraise. Skills, skills. First skill mentioned was Salesforce. So although they don't, although they don't mention Salesforce in the description, I suspect they use they use it for fundraising. So go ahead, go ahead and talk to them. Upbeat. What does Upbeat have? Okay, so here you'll be managing the database, the Salesforce database. This is awesome. Let's go and apply here, guys. All right. So see, as you remember, all I did was. On the advanced opportunity search, put in the keyword Salesforce and indicate the city I'm looking in. All right. So go out and go out and use this. Find your the Salesforce internship. Okay. Next website is called catchafire.org. I clicked find a project, and I'm looking for a project. I'm looking for I can pretty much work in any if you have a preference for the certain cause you can indicate but right now our preference is just anything uh, where I can get Salesforce experience right so I'll just select everything I wish there was a Oh, look, profile settings. Let's change it. Let's just select all. Select all. 
All right, I'm on the web website catchafire.org. Selected all possible causes. I have. I said I have all these skills, but the keyword I'm really searching for is Salesforce. And let's see what I what we got. Okay, here we go. Look at this interesting Salesforce training. Let's keep going and see what else. Brochure, email, fundraising campaigns. This could be Salesforce as well. Related to Marketing Cloud. Brand, so a lot of design stuff. And report. Okay, tech systems. All right, look. Okay, nothing else on this page. Let's go to the next one. Further. Nothing about Salesforce here. Let's go further. Nothing else. I think this is. There are more pages, but we'll stop here. You get the idea, right? So let's look at the first one. So Norma at Nicholas House Inc. is looking for one day intensive Salesforce training for their five staff members. Communicate with supporters. Great. So this is going to be like a research project. You prepare for it for one week. And then you share your knowledge over over a day. I think this is an amazing opportunity. It's in Atlanta. Wow, awesome. If you're in Atlanta, you should definitely apply for this. And this one, let's see how what they say about Salesforce. Nothing about Salesforce. Okay, this looks like it doesn't make any sense. All right. So this is the next, this is taprootplus.org and I'm looking for Salesforce opportunities. Look, this one is looking for Salesforce integration. This one is Salesforce business analysis customization. Okay, this one is interesting. This is promising. Tracking fundraising. Okay, Salesforce to track fundraising and sales revenue by location. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. All right, so if you're New York, definitely apply for this, okay? Apply for this activity using your LinkedIn. Awesome, okay, we just found one great internship opportunity. Last thing I suggest you do is make a post similar to this. Garrett Gosling made a post. I want to volunteer my help, my time to help a nonprofit. He talks about his about his certification, how much time he has, and his location. Do something similar. Look, people responded to him, giving him ideas. Go ahead and do the same. So you just saw different websites that you can use to find Salesforce internships. The opportunities out there. Now the go out and apply. Talk to the organizations. All right. If there is an organization, if these organizations, if these opportunities are not in the city that you're in, talk to the largest nonprofits in your area. I bet they're using Salesforce for fundraising at least. Or they maybe they are considering using Salesforce and you can be the one helping them make the transition. If you found a Salesforce internships using other tools and you have ideas and you have other ideas on how to find Salesforce internships, Leave a comment, share your experience.